running through the final checks before takeoff. These young cadets hope to form part of China's future aviation industry. The AVIC International Flight Training Academy in the Klenkeru town of Oldsworen has become an integral part of training the country's future pilots. Lack of training facilities in China means they'll hone their skills in these skies. China's state-owned AVIC has invested around $20 million in this academy to help equip with the necessary resources to train the cadets, all part of a broader venture to outsource flying skills for future students. There's a huge boom in aviation in China. They require 2,500 pilots per year over the next 15 years. And uh, we have uh, established a joint venture with a university in, in China, Nanjing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics. And uh, we have a contract to train uh, pilots for various Chinese airlines um, in conjunction with Avic International, which is a large company in, in China. South Africa is known as a country with a high level of aviation training and the skills being acquired here will be key in their future development. So after the taxi always? 110 flight cadets are being stationed here in Oatshorn with a further 80 at a nearby base in George. Their training will begin from scratch right up to piloting a commercial jet. Basically they will start to train from uh, as a student pilot and then uh, private pilot and then commercial pilot and then after that we'll, we'll go to George for the high performance and then go back to China as uh, airline pilots. For these cadets their theory is important to impart the necessary knowledge of the various flight controls but it's when they take control of the actual aircraft that they really begin to show their newfound skills. The Cape's Glenguru region may indeed be a far away from home but some of these cadets firmly have their sights set on soaring through the skies of China. My dream is to be a pilot of an airline uh, in China. And uh, I'm working for it now. I think it's a hard time, but I can do it. I think I, I will be successful. Yeah. Since I was four, um, all I wanted to do in my life is, is trying to become a pilot. And finally, I, I got a chance from, from, from China and they they sent me here to, to finish my training and after that I would be sent back to China and to fly the airline and I will be a captain then, I think. Many of the cadets are intent on finishing their aviation training so that they can return home and begin their careers in China's burgeoning airline industry and many seem to be well on their way. That was Andrew, CCTV, Oatsworth.